What was the most painful <laughs> stunt or uh, thing that you did? Oh, that's ja- a good one. Jackass worthy. Because I know you do a lot of crazy stuff. I just saw you stapled your tongue on Instagram. That was more that messed was painful. up what than I thought. Huh? Yeah, savage. Did Didn't we throw something We threw some, some, something on his nuts did from the rooftop, remember? Yeah, that was hot. I got yeah, yeah, that was hot. <laughs> I got a hell of a stunt right now, bro, and it could go viral if you guys want to do it. Right now, I'm gonna whip my thing out, and this goes called. I'm gonna be like, my name is Chad Tepper, and this is the three way bite, and you guys just bite. Oh, down. fuck! Okay, dude, I was like, <laughs> excited. I was like, wow. Shit took a fucking go, turn. Guys. I was like, where are we going with and then this? It goes yeah. To this. Wow. Yeah. Three. The what? Wow. What'd you call it? <laughs> I don't even know where to go from that. Play that back. Listen, Bam Margera would do it. He was. So are you are you good friends with the jackass guys? Who are oh. you friends with out of those guys? Do you know what's crazy? You would think they're filming. Would they're be, filming more, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. You would think that I would be BFFs for life with a lot of those dudes, but I've I met Steve-O a few times, and when I've met him, uh, I was intoxicated a little bit, and he's super soby. So right. Um, I was hanging out with him and MGK and the dudes the dude that produced workaholics and they were doing like a racquetball or tennis racquetball i don't know some shit i was high when i was there but um <laughs> i was outside smoking weed and i was like what's up steve-o and he's like yo and then i was like hit, hitting the whip it <laughs> oh no and like he's like he's just he's over that no yeah more, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what no hey i'm talking about whip it like y'all watch me whip whip and watch right me in it. that's no. a, you guys bro i wasn't doing that no we're talking about doing I, the listen, dance guys, right yeah i never Steve-O, did drugs in my life steve hates to dance he'll never ever. do the whip it ever again no so like i'm compl- <laughs> i'm completely clean and sober right now i've been i've been clean for a year and a half i've been sober now for a week and a half oh there you yeah go, bro. <laughs> Well, hey, no, that's good though. I think you told us that you were sober last time, so you've definitely been trying to to go the sober route, right? Yeah, I mean, I've been clean off all drugs. I don't do anything. I don't even there smoke weed anymore. But you that's know what? Man. I like to dabble in drinking once in a while. In the past couple of months, I've been dabbling more than I should. That's fun. So Fair enough. I was like, I need to cut this shit out completely. So last weekend. I got a little too much and I was over here dancing, partying, you know, and then I was like, I'm done with this shit, bro. <laughs> there you go. Take so, a break, you know? Yeah. But Steve O's a cool dude, bro. You know, I hung out with Bear My a few times. He's he's fucking awesome. I feel like a lot of these dudes don't like the younger dudes like me because And why is that? What do you think that is? <sighs> Are they threatened or what's the deal? No, no, no. I, I just think that they think we're lame. <laughs> Oh, which is like I get it. They they probably were so used to such high level stunts and like you know because yeah. they had big budgets, you know. But I, th- I think the the youth is getting uh, now, doing it themselves now, where it's like yeah, you're, you're risking more. You're doing reason. Instagram things with a stapler and you're getting millions they, of views. They yeah. gotta embrace they, it. They gotta embrace it. Come on, it, yeah. it's, it's just like old rappers not embracing new rappers. Don't be foolish. Come on. But that's the yeah, way. Exactly. But a embrace. lot of people are like that. That's what I think is so cool about the the pop punk world. Like I'm collaborating, collaborating with these right, giant cool. names, multi platinum artists. Like, bro, the dude from Bowling for Soup made the Phineas and Ferb fucking opening. He oh, made the Jimmy oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You're opening. right. Like, that's fucking true, sick. You're, that's really? so true. Yeah, I, didn't know that. These, I forgot about that. These, wow. these these are like that's awesome. Iconic dudes, and and, yes. and I had a phone call with them, and there and it, Jared was just like, man, I love this because I'm like passing the torch on to you, and you're like carrying the torch for pop punk music, and it's it's cool. Some people will support the new people. Some people won't. Right. You know, like Dave England from Jackass. I, I filmed a, a, a series with him called Send It City. And he was super fucking cool, man. Like, gave me sure. his number. He's like, let's kick it. Let's film some shit. Let's have some fun. So he was super cool. And, you know, it is what it is. One, one day I'll see him and I'll blow them all, bro. All right. <laughs> <Until then. laughs> what, was there ever a stunt that you did that you were legitimately scared for? Like, I don't know if I'm going to do this. You were about to back out. You were just overwhelmed in your head. Cause you seem pretty. Everything is normal. I mean, I kicked you straight up in the nuts, and you didn't even flinch. Yeah, yeah that's wild, bro. I would never last. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's like, oh. Hit yeah, it. you feeling, Kev? Is that all right? Okay. You're just. <laughs> I'm okay. That's you know, man. Oh, a stunt that I. There, there was one that I jumped off a 40 foot. Jesus. Like balcony onto a five foot bounce house. You're kidding. That sounds scary. And yeah. that's not that's terrible. The thing that's is wild. with heights, one wrong move and you're paralyzed or dead. Yep. So that really scared the crap out of me. But and th- this and this is nuts, bro. When I jumped off, the bounce house is right here. I jumped off and I landed on the edge. 
Oh man! If I would have been an inch further, I I could have died, bro. I, or or game over. I'm not walking anymore. So doing that, I remember I was whole, over the edge looking at it. And I'm like, when you start getting up there, you're shaking like a bacon, bro. You're like, ah, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. And then your Fine. homie's in your ear like, <clears throat> oh, sorry about that. Uh, your ho- <laughs> oh, sorry about that. And then your homie's in your ear. <laughs> your homie's in your ear like, bro, you got this. You got this. And I did it. And I did. I, I got this. You know, just like Borat. You'll never I, get I this. I got You'll this. never get this. La, 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 la. And then he break out of the cage and he got it, you know? Of course. Yeah. He, of course you did it's, it. It's always good to fly. But, I, man, to be real it's with you, like, I'm like, this big, like, record label dude was just like, you know, we see Chad stapling his mouth together in his tongue. Uh, how do we know that when he gets big and we design him that he's not going to hurt his tongue and we're going to lose our investment? And it's just like, bro, like, I like doing stupid fucking shit. I don't always do stupid shit. It's like, but, so I have a lisp. Yeah. I mean, who cares, right? <laughs> yeah, who cares? <laughs> who cares? Yeah. That's yeah. going to be good for the thong. Yeah. But the thing is, like, a lot of me doing stupid shit is because... I'm having fun, but a lot of it too is like, I'm trying to make money, bro. And I'm trying to open up my life to my music and my fans want to see me do dumb shit. So I got to do this until my music takes off. And when my music takes off, I'm going to calm down a little bit on the stupid shit for sure. Right. Cause I don't want to fucking get paralyzed. I don't want to die. I don't want to get hurt really bad. Like I see that. And it's just like, I understand that, you know, but it's just, this is just who I am growing up watching Jackass, CKY, yeah. like Viva La Bam. Being Doing your ins- thing, you know, yourself. Wild yeah. Boys, yeah. Wild well, Boys. Yeah, you don't have to follow and like, you know, do whatever they want you to do and yeah. fit to the mold. Do yeah. your thing, bro. Thank Go crazy you, with it, bro. You're, ki- you're killing it. I got a question for you. Yes, um, I'm into it. Hold my, <laughs> oh, my hand. Uh, what do you think your next crazy stunt's gonna be? Yeah, Making out with you. Oh, <laughs> Chad, <laughs> this is getting erotic <laughs> over here. <laughs> She's getting crazy. Okay, let me put on my cheat mask code podcast X rated. Oh. That was nice, it. guys. It was a wow. little wet there. There you go. That was. Oh, oh, that just happened. <laughs> That's that, right, that clip right there. That, that clip it's is going real. viral. That's a real clip. That was the coronavirus. Look, if you want a clip right to really go viral, like we should have given him a bigger reaction. That that was a big moment that we just sort of just like. Hey guys, it's safe over. to kiss. We got the vaccines. We can kiss again. Woo! It's kiss season. Everybody that be living it up, we say yeah. what? 